Remember that we have actually started talking about digital image is a function, and this is something we've covered in the previous set of sub-lectures. What I have introduced in those lectures is that we can actually talk about an image basically as a function with, uh, we can actually look at an x and y axis with the intensity in the third dimension that has allowed us to create images uh, or looking at images like this one, the mandrel image we've looked at before. And the bottom line of all of this has been that we want to be able to represent an image as a matrix where we can now traverse through this matrix and discrete indices i and j to be able to get any kind of value that we would be interested in to then, for example, extract content and, for example, look at the intensities at specific values and do some sort of processing with it.